Riaz Lala is uh, someone who looks after the majority of this. He's my uh, cousin. He's a lovely, lovely, lovely guy as well. So he's looking after this part. So look, they'll use the freshest vegetables, the freshest meat and the finest ingredients. Okay, at the Ocean City Resort, should you choose to uh, stay here and eat from here? And I'll tell you a little bit more about the resort fairly shortly. So during the month of uh, uh, Ramadan, uh, Tiazza has a very, uh, uh, how do you say, he's very phil philanthropic, I can't even say it, right? Phil philanthropy, phil phil he's a bit of a philanthropist, philanthropist. Um, and during the month of um, uh, uh, Ramadan, they would cook for, they would cook the Ithari um, and Sehri meals for hundreds of people in this particular uh, uh, area here. See lots of sort of like beds um, in there as well. The workers would, would stay here and they would uh, provide food um, to hundreds of people completely uh, free of charge at the Ocean City Resort here in Versailles. You stupid cow. Ha ha. <laughs> okay, look, here we have a couple of cows. Yeah, they, I, I don't know if you can uh, how clear you can see in the camera, but they're beautifully clean, really, really clean, really well uh, looked after. And look, here's another mate of ours as well, uh, Buffalo. <laughs> Hello. Yes, and back to Imti Azlala. He's a philanthropist um, involved in charity. Uh, he's a giver. Has huge investment. Uh, in in Versailles, yeah, involved in uh, many, uh, many, many uh, good, good, good projects. He, oh, there we go. Look, look what we've got coming in. So the shepherds are just bringing some of the. They look like goats from here because it's a long way away. Let's go a little bit closer. Yeah. So I'm saying Imtiaz Lala. Okay, Imtiaz Lala's full title is Imtiaz Ahmed Kaka Khil. And for you Bradfordians, you will also know that he uh, has a home in uh, West Bowling in, in Bradford. So let's have a look what the shepherds have brought brought back in. There we go, look. Oops, there you go. a whole load of goats. So it's the goat shepherd. So let me tell you a little bit more about Ocean City Resort whilst I'm here. Uh, the official opening has just recently been, been done and it's a hotel. Oops, there you go. It's a hotel, so it's a hotel uh, and a resort as well, aimed at uh, a, a primarily an international uh, audience. So if I just turn my camera around, so <laughs> as the supermarket, so does that look familiar? Does it look like it might have just been uh, copied from somewhere else it's just a possibility isn't it so hotel and uh, and, and resorts okay in in Versailles I believe there's gonna be shops on the bottom it looks like we have a restaurant and like anywhere look we always have a place that's selling some burgers so burger bars uh, eatery restaurant on my right hand side as well I believe um, the pizza uh, uh, pizza shop is that what you call it pizza shop uh, has already started uh, doing business um, up on the top floor there okay I believe there's going to be a gym there's go going to be uh, a, a, a gym as well and I was talking to my cousin recently and he was telling me that uh, people that come from abroad into uh, the area okay for a whole range of uh, sports one of them that horse racing and there's um, a community of people that travel from uh, the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, uh, Dubai, Kuwait, Oman, etc. that come for horse racing in Bradford or, uh, or come to buy horses as well. So this will be an ideal location here in the Sain District Uttuk where they can come and stay and make their moves uh, from here as well. A lot we have. We have an international range of uh, flags there as well. And we have my brother who's just... We have top security. So we have, look, top security as well. Abkanambai. Khaber Khan. Oh, Khaber Khan. Oh, mashallah. So, we're going to Khaber Khan by either. We're going to add the last kitchen in your loba. This is a catastrophe. If you mess with this guy, look what he's got in his hand. <laughs> so, do not mess Khaber Khan by his region of Rane. You can use your does, 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 right? <laughs> <laughs> so Khaber Khan is, uh, is uh, the security as well and as you can see look he's a nice friendly guy but apparently these things are, are sometimes needed 
and here are the vehicles that um, are, will also be used from here as well so when tourists come in they'll go and collect them from the airport uh, and bring them here as well so look the, a means of advertising is just I'm in Vesar so I'm just spreading information so if you come and if you come, want to come and stay here and you make a call then this is not advertising remember it's not advertising say I saw it on a blog about Vesar which was made by Javez Khan so will you please send him a massive check in commission if you do that that would be really nice but if you do not do that that would be really nice as well <laughs> so look let's go up the stairs and see what we can what we can find yeah and if I end up dancing at the top okay please do not blame me there just seems to be lots of light and it looks really nice but there's no music but there's a hall so perhaps I can turn it into something I have no idea what's around the corner Oh, around the corner we have a reception area and we have somebody at Istiqbalia. Oh, right, okay. So here we go, look, up the stairs. And what have I found here? That's me, you found me here. What have I found? And, oh, one of my favourite places in the world. I have found the gym. Oh, and look at this. And look what I found. I found... The gym, one of my favourite places in the world. We have the latest equipment and we have somebody in Istik Balia here as well. Asalaamu As Alaikum, bye. Asalaamu Alaikum, bye. So look. Oh, we have people training. Huh? Talk about air conditioning, the latest equipment in the middle of like nowhere. You have, it, you have it all here. So if you're like me and you like to have a little bit of a workout, you're in a good place. Look, a variety of free range weights, lots of belts. Slowly come by. And look, lots of other uh, equipment as well. So if you're a, a gym freak, if you're a gym goer, and the gym's name is, and the gym is called Blade Fitness. I you to uh, do this the right way around, and he's going to tell you a little bit about the gym. Blade Fitness. Slowly come by, Robert. By Biber, gym ke thoda detail hume de de, membership kitna hai, kaise join karna hai, process kya hai? Gym, aapko two packages hain. Usme ek silver package, usme 1500 rupee monthly hai. Aur gold package, usme 2000 hai. Aur kapre? 2000 mein aapko coaching included hai. Okay. Aur Great, okay. Or personal uh, training ka kya hai gante ke saab se ya package hai uske baare mein? Ye included hai. So, agar koi personal training karna chata hai to per hour maslan? Personal training, filan ye hi hai, just guidance. Okay, just guidance. Okay, just guidance. Okay, just guidance. Moment. Okay, it's just um, uh, free training. There aren't any uh, personal trainers here, but they will arri uh, arrive fairly soon. So Barbara's just giving you some general information. So if you want to join, come and speak to these guys. Thank you, bye, Barbara. Jazakallah. Thank you, brother. So why should you join the gym? Why should you exercise? Hey, to have great intentions, to give, to have good health, to carry out the commandments of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. That you can do with good health. What Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala requires us to do in the way Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa has shown us. So have great intention when you uh, do anything that's related to health. Talking about health, we are on the top floor of the building. And look what I found. A swimming pool. Would you believe it? On the top floor of the building it appears to be about maybe I don't know 35 40 feet going that way and probably a good 20 to 25 feet uh, going this way and it's probably about um, probably about six foot I would say ish or probably less because I can't see any markers and it's just a little bit of guesswork. So there's one swimming pool here and there's another swimming pool over there. And that looks like a pool table, I think, or a snooker table over there. So it's at initial stages, only opened 
uh, some days ago there's still lots and lots of work um, to do and I've just kicked a box of match oh and here we go look changing rooms nice facilities it's a little bit dark I don't know where the light switch is light switch light switch light switch oh there we go look very decent facilities look shower areas oops we'll go that way come back this way so look very very decent for this part of the world and here's another swimming pool and then on the right hand side look there's a bathing area there it's um, the sun is now set and it's getting a little bit darker so here's the first so I was the first person in the history of Islamabad Hills so I was the first person in the history of Islamabad Hills let's scratch my ear let me start again I was the first person in the history of Islamabad Hills to become the I can't even say this let me do this again it's a comedy show this right I was the first person to invest in Islamabad Hills in Pakistan for Diyar Homes so I made history so I am the first person ever to swim and paddle at the Ocean City Resort Resorts swimming pool So would you like to watch this history? Let me repeat again. Would you like to watch this piece of history? Oh well, you're going to watch it anyway. Obviously, I'm not going to allow you to watch me swimming and paddling.